There! No! Over there! <gasps> the coconut! It's gone! Tweak! Spotlight! Nothing! Let's take a closer look. Octonauts, let's search the area. I'll head right, Quasi. You head left and... I'll stay right here with the penguin. The name's Claude, but my friends call me the Claw. On account of the fact that I like to crack coconuts open with it. But I'm not a coconut. Ah, oh, sorry. Don't worry, you're not very crackable. <laughs> Hello, darling. Look, there's my wife, Claudette. But her friends call her... The Claw! These here are my sons, Clive, Clem and Clarence. But you can call us... The Claws? Uh, yeah, how did you guess? Yeah, how'd you guess? Oh, I want to thank you all for finding this here coconut of ours. It rolled into the ocean days ago, and since we can't swim, we couldn't go after it. Now, if you don't mind, we'll be taking it on home where it belongs. Just drop anchor right there. That's my coconut. Now, hold on, son. This coconut's belonged to us for many years, so it stays with us. Yeah, yeah, it stays with us. But that very same coconut bears the mark of me grandfather, Calico Jack. <gasps> you and Calico Jack are family? Oh, well, uh, now that you mention it, you do kind of look like him. Thanks. So maybe you'd like to tell me how you ended up with my grandfather's coconut. It was many years ago that Calico Jack washed up on the shores of this here very island. He was shipwrecked and hungry. We nursed him back to health with coconut milk, and in return, he told us rip-roaring tales of the open sea. When we woke, he was gone. No note, no nothing. Just this coconut, which we've been trying to crack open ever since. It's downright embarrassing. I mean, cracking coconuts is what we do. Yeah, it's what we do. Well, we couldn't crack it, and you couldn't crack it. Perhaps if we work together, we can all crack it. Then let's get cracking. You two crack while we pull. One, two, three. Deploy the rescue suction line. Aye, aye, Cap. No sign of the creatures yet. No sign of Peso's medical bag either. It could be anywhere in this murky muck. Oh, looks like we've got company. Quasi, you keep them distracted while I search the riverbed. Ready? Ready, Captain. Then let's do this. Hey, you duck-faced furball! Over here! I'm not scared of you, whatever you are! Ah, sure. It's around here somewhere. I did it, Captain! Oh! Oh! I led those monsters on a wild goose chase! They'll never find us now! This time, Quasi, you look for the bag, and I'll lead the creatures away. Aye, aye, Captain. Hey! Up here! That's it! <laughs> here I am! What's taking the Captain and Quasi so long? Don't worry, Shellington. They'll be back soon. I hope. Ah! Lappity flippers! The egg's hatching! Whoa! <laughs> Shiver whiskers! Peso's bag! Look out, Quasi! Quasi, this way! Shellington, look! Oh, fascinating. A bill. A furry tail. A webbed claw. It's a duck-faced river monster. And it's really cute. Oh, jumping jellyfish. 
that's no monster. It's a baby platypus. A platypus? Uh, platypuses are river creatures that lay eggs. They only live here in Australia. Then those creatures outside must be platypuses too. That's right. And platypus fathers have stingers on their back legs. No wonder he stung me. They want their baby back. I'd better get it back to them before anyone else gets hurt. Careful on that leg, Shellington. I'll be right back. Ah, how do they keep finding us in the dark? We're trapped. Huh? <laughs> We've got you right where we want. Now hand it over. Um, excuse me? And what over? Not going to cooperate, huh? All right then. Get ready to feel the sting. Stop! Look. Our baby. He's got your bill. <laughs> and your tail. A baby duck-faced monster. It's not a duck-faced monster. It's a duck-billed platypus. It hatched from that egg you found. I'd like to take a look at your fin. Then I can. Oh. As I was saying, I. Oh, I know I should just say thank you for trying to help me. But a shark's got to eat. <laughs> you can't eat the cup eggs. He's getting tired, and if he gets too tired, he'll stop moving and he won't be able to breathe. Then we need to act fast. Quasi, can you go out there and distract the shark while I flip him over? My pleasure, Captain. Yow! Oh, you shark! Can you not see I'm trying to eat? You can't take a bite out of that. Plus, I'm a lot tastier. Seriously? Ooh, I'll try anything once. Well, you'll have to catch me first, matey. Woohoo! Oh! My fin hurts, mm, but I'm still gonna get you. <laughs> yeah, shocky, shocky. Follow me this way. Ah, good work, Quasi. And flick. Oh, I feel so calm. Do you still want to eat us? Why would I want to eat you? I just want to be your friend. Captain, he's in a trance. Calm as a clam. Time for the next part of the plan. <laughs> that kind of tickles. <laughs> Good for a ride. Okay, the shark is calm, he's moving, and he's breathing. Now I can bandage his fin. Be careful, Peso, and quick. The shark won't be calm for long. Right ho, Peso. Nice and steady. <laughs> Ooh, a wee penguin. I'm here to bandage your fin. <laughs> that tickles, Pop. <laughs> uh oh, I didn't know you were ticklish. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Just have to get down to the fin. Okay, I think this calls for a super speedy triple loop around the shark fin wrap. Hurry, Peso. He could come out of his trance any second. There. Good as new. How do you feel? Oh, good. I'm hungry. Oh, no. You're out of your trance. Peso! Flappity flippers. You saved my life. I should just say thank you, but I'm hungrier than ever. Hop on, matey. A cat, a penguin, and a crunchy motor thingy. That's an all you can eat party! Actually, it looks like I've got you. I got me, octopus! I won't be able to follow that pup anywhere if that octopus gets her first. Uh, I know! Ah, take a shot! <laughs> Tweak's new camouflage worked like a charm. That old octopus thought I was a... <gasps> Take a shark! Wait! I'm not really a 
tiger shark, I... Oh, these little pups really do get confused by the cups. Quasi to Shellington. I'm following one of the hammerhead pups. And she's a wild one. Good work, Quasi. Don't lose her now. Well, that's two of the hammerhead pups. Just one more to find. I can smell food. I just can't see it. <coughs> you can't get away from me. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, my head is stuck. <laughs> hey, somebody help! Look, down there. The third hammerhead. And he's stuck. We're the Octonauts. We're here to help. <laughs> he's really stuck. We'd better call for backup. There, the last one. Peso, Quasi, come in. We found the third pup, but his head is stuck. We need your help. Stuck? We've got to help me, brother! Captain, we're on our way! <laughs> come on, our brother's in trouble! Oh, no! Ahoy, Peso! These little pups put up a good chase, don't they? You're telling me? Peso, Quasi, over here. Oh, oh, ouch. This does me feel too good. Some slippery ointment should help slide his hammerhead out. Good idea. Everyone else, grab a fin. There. Don't worry. We'll have you out and swimming in no time. On my count, everyone pull. Ready? Three, two, one. Uh, guys, look behind me. Oh, fascinating! Hammerhead's eyes allow them to see what's behind them, like that... Shark! <gasps> this should give him something to chew on! Hey, those things don't taste too good, do they? I'm sure you taste a lot better! <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, bet you can't catch me! <laughs> Peso, follow me and bring your friend. Octonauts, let's find that snake. <gasps> that whirlpool is stronger than we thought. Dashy, activate steering wheel. Aye, aye, Captain. I am so getting off this ship. Follow that snake! This must lead to the sea. Oh no, you don't! <laughs> Captain, the snake is escaping through the lab vent. Let me see if I can help. I need to get into the sea. Why are you trying to stop me? We're just trying to help. There's a dangerous whirlpool out there. If you go out now, you'll get sucked right in. Seriously? We're so serious. So, can we bring you back to your eggs until the whirlpool passes? That's not how it usually works, Penguin, but sure. They hatched! That's great! But, um, where are the babies? When baby sea crates hatch, the first thing they do is look for... Water! 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 Find water! 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 Find water! Captain! Dashi! Come in! The eggs have hatched! Is it safe for the snakes to leave the octopod? It's not safe at all! They'll get sucked right into the whirlpool! Find those baby snakes and keep them on the octopod. Repeat, keep those snakes on the octopod. Oh. 
five baby sea snakes. How many should there be altogether? Six. Yeah, one of them's missing. What's going on down there? One of the snakes reversed the ship. I'll try to change direction. It's no use, we're getting sucked in! Any sign of it, Tweak? Nope, nothing yet, Cap. Huh? There's that sea turtle again. The rover cam was following him when it broke. Let's ask if he's seen it. Yeah, he disappeared again. Over there. Let's try and catch up with him. There he goes. Here he goes. There he goes. Now which way did he go? Lost the glider and the octus ski. And the captain and Quasi. Tweak to Captain Barnacles. Come in. Cap? Quasi? Oh, it's no use. The radio's broken too. Tweak? Peso? Are you alright? We've lost contact with the rest of the Gup X. You mean it's vanished? No, it's out there. We just need to find it. But first, we need to get the glider moving. Let's go out and check on the damage. First things first, Peso. I gotta fix the Gup connector. Gup connector? I designed the Gup X so the different sections would always be able to find each other. Once the Gup connector is working, it'll pull all the other parts of the Gup X back together. Along with the Captain and Quasi. That's right. Now, can you hand me a number nine spanner? Of course. Lost its slimy seaweed. We'll have to pull it out. Who said that? I knew it. This sea is full of ghosts. I thought you said it was full of sea monsters. That too? Whatever you be, you'd best be gone. I can't. Huh? I'm stuck, very possibly forever. Oh! <gasps> A loggerhead sea turtle. The name's Lenny, and my shell is hard enough to protect me for now, but this thing's getting really heavy. Don't worry, Lenny. We are the Octonauts, and we'll get you out safely. You may want to pull your head and flippers into your shell just to be safe. Oh, wish I could. We loggerhead sea turtles can't hide inside our shells. Our heads and flippers are too big.